Hey guys, cool blonde wave back. I'm Aaron. I'm Rick. Eric. And we are back. We're here for the first time, or whatever, for Falcon and the Winter Soldier trailer that was dropped at the Super Bowl game. Super Bowl. That's yeah. You guys watch Super Bowl? Pretty crazy stuff, right? No, I didn't watch it. Although I did, I did catch up one part because someone was talking about it with my guild for a while because I was playing like a, a real game. <laughs> and uh, I went to like, oh, what's he got? And I went to the CBS stream, and like yeah. this one throw was happening. Uh -huh. and this guy went to go get it. Yep. And it bounced off his hand and went up. And the other team was like, hey. And he took it. <laughs> and he ran. And I was like, that sucks. <laughs> Dude, I want you to commentate sports. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, well, uh, the Super Bowl trailer for Falcon versus... Nope, I don't want to say versus. No, it's Falcon Godzilla. Oh, and the Winter Soldier. That would be, some, be, that'd be some hell of they, uh, a lot of stuff. There's already been enough verses. They, they versed in the first movie he was in. Is that? Kind of. I suppose you're I mean, right. He, he was against him. Yeah. And they, were, he, they were against... Yeah, that's how it worked. Throwing that knife and catching it in cool ways and stabbing people. I love yeah. it. And yeah, metal arm catching... Yeah, uh, well, we're currently watching WandaVision. This comes out like two or three weeks after WandaVision, so oh, we're going to go right into the next yay. Marvel show, and I'm excited to see more about what this show is going to be like. And then Loki. Yep. So, awesome. Winter Soldier. Who would like to start? Are they in trouble? Mr. Barnes, why does Sam aggravate you? It's there. seconds to drop. It is so what's therapy. our plan? Great. It looks really good. Superheroes cannot be allowed to <laughs> exist. Who's that? Is that Zemo? I have no intention to leave my work. I. It's Baron Zemo. They should have killed him. Wait. Didn't they? No, he didn't die. March 19th. This is Hitman right there. Here we go again. Huh? Sharon Carter. Oh. I didn't oh, that's a cool little symbol. Oh, I love it. He has his own shields. Watch them in like couples therapy, and that I could mean, be the show. We're, we're probably going to be seeing some of that. That's all I need. Some more couples therapy there. Yeah. I mean, they should have killed Zemo. Uh. To kill. When I was going, when I was like, they should have killed him. And I look yeah. back, I'm like, wait, didn't they? And I was trying to remember what happened, but there was the gun, and then they stopped him. Yeah, with Black Panther and all that. But uh, this is. He at least has the mask here too, which is yeah. nice. Yeah, he didn't have a mask before. He did not have that mask. Um. Yeah, that looks fun. I mean, it looks way more conventional of a Marvel project than, let's say, WandaVision is right now. Yeah. <laughs> more action. Well, more it looks action. like it could be a Marvel movie. Like, yeah. That trailer looks like it could have been into a movie or something like that, but instead we're going to get a TV show with more episodes, more time with these characters. It'd be great. Hell yeah. I mean, you know, I already see here that it's going to be like, obviously, you know, uh, Falcon and Winter Soldier bouncing off each other, but the vacuum of filling Captain America's shoes, you know? Yeah. We see them both with the shield throwing it. It looks like they were playing frisbee at one point, but it was just editing. <laughs> well, yeah, it looked like he threw it at the tree, and then like it bounced off, and the other guy caught it yeah. or something. But I don't know. Maybe that's, um, maybe that's but they it. also have this character in here that is playing Captain America like at a football game or something, you know? Go back to the logo for that, because the logo for that looked kind of, didn't it look like the A, but then like it had wings coming off it or something? I don't think it was the star, but it could have been the star, too. Well, so the A yeah, is made like to wings. look like a star. So it's the conventional star uh, shape. Very good design. I suppose so, but it also could be like, like for Falcon, it could be Captain America, mm -hmm. but with wings. I suppose so. I, I think they're also behind it, like yeah. the way those are. Now, I, I you Makes know, me think of that. The marching band itself is in the star shape as yeah, well. For sure. Um, 
And he's always had the star on the shield. Yeah, I but too, I mean, but. is you know, is this going to be similar to like you know, <clears throat> is it going to be like U.S. Agent? There's a lot of different like Captain Americas that try to fill those shoes. Falco's not the only oh, one. Oh yeah, and, and well, Bucky did well, it. Well, Bucky and too, Falco both you know? have been in the comics at different points. So I, I kind of feel like is, is it possible that we have more than just those two trying to fill in those shoes? You know? <sighs> yeah, maybe it's possible. And then you know Zemo. Talking here about like there should be no superheroes. There should be no superheroes. Which I mean, he owes probably. I don't know if he was blipped or not, but he might owe his very existence. I mean, yeah, <laughs> a lot of superheroes. Do, right? Yeah. I hope we get an awesome sword fight with Zemo. Uh, awesome sword fight. Yeah, he's he uses like a rapier. I really like uh, Zemo in the comics, and I liked him in the uh, the movie Civil War as well. Um, I liked his, you know, the trickery involved with Zemo. You know, I hope one day we get this version of Zemo to go like uh, Thunderbolt style in the comics, which would be f fantastic. And if you don't know what that is, you're gonna love it if, if they ever do it. So I don't want to lose Baron Zemo before that happens. Gotcha. Um, anyway, well, uh, and you know that might be really good for like a Disney Plus series as well. So well, hopefully they do. What they should do, and it's not just to kill off everybody at the end of every movie or every exactly. TV show or whatever anyway, because I hate when they do that, and then you never get to bring them back. Yeah. Or maybe you can if you're going to do some weird WandaVision things or something. I don't know. Speaking of bringing back, though, we had Sharon Carter in here, yeah. which was cool to see. Uh, is it, is she, who is it, Agent 33? I'm getting that wrong, aren't I? Isn't right. 33 from S.H.I.E.L.D.? Either way, uh, Sharon Carter, who is Peggy Carter's niece, that Steve left to go bang her in. <laughs> like, what? Wasn't Steve like getting together with the niece too? Um, I mean, Falcon Winter Soldier had like that look with each other whenever he was like, he was kissing. Yeah. And then that. he's like, eh. I don't, yeah, I guess. Yeah. It, well, then, but then it worked on the end. Did it? I think. Well, we don't know. They were dancing. We have all these split timelines. We don't know what Steve did. He was dancing. That's true. Uh, so we got her back. There's also a, a female character that I do not recognize with like a black mask and orange markings. I'm not sure if that is a uh, uh, who that is. Well, that little girl kicked your ass. <laughs> that that little girl said. kicked your ass. The way you said it was great. <laughs> and then you just went under. Uh, I, you know, whenever you said Matrix, whenever we saw that. Yeah, the two trucks. I can never ever. And Rick, I know that you haven't seen uh, the last two Matrix movies, but I could never uh, be on a highway and not think about Morpheus versus that agent. On a truck, yeah, it, it will always. It, it's in my mind every single time I go on a road trip. Every time you're on a road trip, every single so time I think of that fight. So will this? Will this one up it? Well, I mean, they, they don't have slow mo. You don't know. They can have some slow mo. How? Wait, the Matrix. Only the Matrix can have slow mo. <laughs> it's part of their thing. Like it's a, it's a shtick. It's part of everything after the Matrix. Yeah, the Matrix. Yeah. yeah. I don't know. If, if Falcon just starts slowing down bullets, it's gonna be like, well, this is weird. I'm taking out. Yeah. Yeah, does that make sense? Yeah. You can't slow it down. So hard to beat that highway scene, but what this might looks like it has over it is that that highway scene in the Matrix, the way they filmed it, uh, they have like these big walls up on the edge of the highway, and it's not just like open road because it was impossible to do something like that then when they did that. Here it looks like open road, so maybe it'll be a little more uh, true to what my highway looks like. Well, you needed to be open for Falco to be able to. Yeah, that's Falco. True. Falco. For, for... <laughs> he's a he's a Nintendo character, but he's got to fly. Get out of my way, Fox! He's got to fly around. Yeah, so exactly. you, you can't have it like just walls, and he's got to like bounce off walls uh -huh. and stuff. But yeah. I love when he I love his shield thing. Yeah, like he before he's done it, he uses his what down B shine move. He, yeah, reflects. I feel like he just yeah exactly. That's why he's Falco. Uh -huh. But I feel like before he just kind of like did this. This time it like made a shield, yeah. like a shield, yeah. shield. Like I mean, power shield. yeah, he, he's definitely done that move before to deflect bullets, but it did look like like a sarcophagus shield in front of him. Yeah, something know? showed up right yeah. here and he put it in the ground. Whereas before cool. he just kind of wrapped himself or something, you know? Yeah, he seemed to have more articulation. Yeah, like I love it, the use of the wings. It was it was kind of like a Doc Ock move almost. Mm -hmm. It's great. Yeah, uh, I'm looking forward to it. I mean, Winter Soldier. I, we should say too the music in here that kind of like. Well, yeah, that that like oh, high pitch, go. that high pitch. I believe they used that in Civil War for the Winter Soldier, and then we also had like a, a, a hip hop song in here as well, which maybe is more marrying the style of Falcon and Winter Soldier together, you know, to make some kind of sound for that. So I thought someone was playing a kazoo. I was like, this is a strange choice. Really? For a soundtrack. Yeah. Uh, every time the Winter Soldier would show up in uh, uh, 
Captain America the Winter Soldier, it would kind of have that like I don't know what reminiscent of like a Wild West kind of like Oh, uh, like what the Mandalorian but instead does. It's like, oh, yeah, yeah, you know, like there's like Bow! it has like that sure. kind of sound. Yeah, okay, I get you. All right, well, uh, that's interesting. Can't wait to see more from this series in March. In March, yes. Uh, make sure you're subscribed because we will be reacting to each and every episode of Falcon and the Winter Soldier. And we're doing one and now, right now. So subscribe to watch that right now. And if you haven't seen our reactions to it, you can go back and watch the first what. Five? You want to watch that fifth one? That was crazy. See you guys next time. Hey guys, Coop Long Way Back. We're done. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure you guys subscribe, just like uh, Eric mentioned, as we're going to be covering uh, Falcon Winter Soldier. We're already covering WandaVision. Loki's coming out. And whatever the hell they're going to do with the movies going forward, maybe we'll get to react to some of those too, like Black Widow. So When? I, I, I don't know when that happens or how, what the rules are. With I don't know. But subscribe so you know when we know that Five you seconds. know.